Bonjour tout le monde. I am here avec uh, Stefano, a French player, Zurich from the team Millennium. Uh, would you like to introduce yourself to people uh -huh. who don't know you? Or would you like me to do it? Just do it. No, you do it. Okay. Uh, I'm Stefano, like you said, from Team Millennium, French player. I'm 18 years old. And uh, I play this for King Gimbal Race, Zurich. That's it. So I know Stefano for about four years, and uh, we first met one time in a Zota Cup, wasn't it? Yeah, Zota Cup. And uh, we've been practicing a little bit since then. He was a Warcraft 3 player as a human race, and since now he's switched to Starcraft 2 and pretty successful. He just got third place here at the Assembly in summer in Finland, 2011, in case you're watching this many years later. And uh, you did pretty well, so uh, tell me something about how you started with your career. I just bought, my brother bought the game, he told me to try it, I tried, I played like one month and then I got, uh, I joined Millennium and since, since uh, this time I keep playing like two hours a day and that's it. And so I think most people will think you're pretty talented because uh, you play very good with little practice. Do you have dreams of becoming a pro gamer? <coughs> I'm asking myself this question recently. Because uh, I don't know what I will do uh, next year. Because I started being good at StarCraft 2, I'm doing quite enough money now. I got a salary for Millennium. I didn't get um, Warcraft 3 as salary. So uh, I don't know if I keep going or focus on studies for now. I have one month to. Uh, to think about it. Think about it. Yeah. Okay, one month is not very long, and you're just 18 years old now, right? Yeah. Yeah. So I also had no idea what I wanted to do at 18. I wish you a lot of luck to figure this out in one month. Um, did you? When did you first find out about like uh, pro gaming in itself? Because when you started with Warcraft 3, did you know the job exists uh, <coughs> already? Uh, not really. I just played fun in Cyber Cafe. Uh, with friends. I was living in Lebanon, so no internet, just playing in LAN and so So I didn't know a thing about uh, living with, uh, by playing uh, games. Right. So when I get back to Tunisia, I had internet, I saw it, I tra started to train and to be, I wanted to be one of the first uh, French players. And, then, uh, and here you are. Yeah. <laughs> Very cool. Uh, so, what is your next tournament going to be? Can you tell <coughs> us something about that? Uh, it's um, in Cologne. I E M. The Gamescom. I E M. Yeah, that's it. Are there uh, groups known for this yet? Yeah, I'm in group with um, Sasi and some Chinese Xiao or something. Like Xiao Ti. Xiao. Uh, X I A O T. Yeah, Xiao. Do you know him from Warcraft Three? Yeah, the orc uh, player, right? Warcraft, yeah. Okay, so he came, that's cool. And he's Protoss now. So you're with two Protoss, anything else? And the fourth player is not known yet. It's a Korean invite? Yeah. Okay, so how do you feel about that? We, we know you're pretty good against Protoss, but <coughs> these are two exceptional players. No, I'm not. It's actually my best, uh, worst ma matchup. I'm better against uh, Terra. I don't know how to do it. I don't know how uh, Xiao plays. I've never seen him. Sasse plays uh, a lot on two bases. And it will be easy, I guess. <laughs> okay, strong words from Stefano. Thank you very much for taking the time no to do this interview with us. And uh, we wish you a lot of luck in IEM. Merci. Pas de problème. <laughs> Pas de problème. Au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir.